You've made it. Now you're a medical student at the Spencer Fox Eccles School of Medicine at University of Utah. But what happens when the world of social media meets the world of medicine? Let's use Sam as an example. Sam is a second year medical student. Like everyone in America, they have the right to free speech. They have a right to speak any way they want online or elsewhere, but should they? Here are some things Sam should think about. Let's say Sam decides to post pictures about how much they're partying on the weekends. Or maybe they share their strong political opinions. Or choose to post racist symbols or make disparaging, hateful, or even racist comments about a particular group of people, even in private messages. How can these actions impact their future as a medical provider or a student here? You all have come so far in your academic career, so you should know that anything you put on the World Wide Web or even send it a text to a friend or family member can potentially live forever. It could even impact your continued schooling, your ability to match in a residency program, and it could even impact your future employment. Years from now, when Sam is practicing medicine, potential patients, future employers, or even patients they're treating may be able to see behind the clinical curtain of what Sam does, says, or shares. That's why it's important to be clinically conscious before sharing too much online, understand the consequences, follow a personal and medical code of ethics, not just in clinic, but online as well. Social media guidelines for healthcare providers at University of Utah encourage you to always show respect. Don't publish content containing slurs, personal insults or attacks, profanity or obscenities, and don't engage in any conduct on a social media site that would not be acceptable in U of U health workplaces. Your profile and content should be consistent in the manner you wish to present yourself to colleagues, patients, parents, students, and others. If Sam chooses to share freely about their life, it could have negative professional and academic consequences. They could be put on academic probation. Or if their behavior online continues to be unacceptable, they could be kicked out of school. The best thing Sam can do is stay mindful of messages they share. And a good rule of thumb, if you wouldn't say it or show it to a patient, it's best kept off the internet.